Yo, what is going on everyone? Guiding Light here back with another Fortnite video and in this one I'll be showing you guys how it is that you can actually survive the storm phases. So this is a pretty confusing challenge. We've seen it come by in the past and I know a lot of people were struggling with it last time and so I wanted to make this video just to clarify exactly what it is that you guys need to do. So this challenge is definitely not hard but I don't want you guys get running around trying to do certain things or getting confused, wasting time. So I'm going to tell you guys exactly how it is to get this one done. So the best way to get the Survive Storm Phases Challenge done is to go into either Team Rumble or Solos. It actually doesn't matter which one that you go in. You're going to get it done a lot faster if you play like a normal match and not Team Rumble. And all you guys actually have to do is just survive until the Storm Circle closes up. So you have to do this 10 different times, and that's why if you do it in a normal game, it will be a lot faster. Because if you come out with a win, I believe there's like 6 or 7 different Storm Phases all in one match. So if you come out with a win, you're definitely going to get it done in two games. But if you just make it to like top five, top 10, you may have to play a few because there's only going to be like maybe four or five storm phases. Now, if you go into team rumble, I believe there's only like two, maybe even only one storm phase. So it will take quite a bit of time to get it done. Honestly, guys, I wouldn't rush this challenge unless you guys are really, really trying to level up fast because no matter what, you're going to get this one done just by playing. But I wanted to make this video just to clarify exactly what needed to be done for the new players and for people that were confused so that you guys don't waste any time. So I hope this video helps you guys out and I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.